going into our top 10 of bands. So in 10, we have Clouds Across the Moon by Passcode. Hey, Passcode. So Passcode is a Japanese metal idol group that was formed in Osaka in 2013 and consists of four vocalists, Nao Minami, Kade, and Takashima. Emily, Arima, and Hinako uh, were the prior members. Uh, Passcode is supported by a backup band, if you guys didn't know about Passcode. Um, I think everyone here probably knows about Passcode. Um, Passcode rules. Um, Susi uh, drops down two spots. At number eight, we have Tatsuya Kitani, Scar, that's staying right there at eight. That's been in the top ten for a while. Londi plummeting down to number seven, dropping four spots. Big changes, guys. Number six, 1OK Rock with their sonic uh, theme song, Vandalize, uh, going down a spot to number six. Number five, we have Zuto Mayo going down three spots. Number four, we have Hanabi A jumping up another two spots. Look at them nice. go, guys. Number four, I really like Hanabi A. I can't wait to see They're what awesome. they come out with next. I'm really excited. I love them. Baby They're Metal, awesome. number three, Metal Kingdom. Number two, TK, First Death drops a spot. And number one, this is new. I don't know what this is. The first slam dunk. It looks feet. like the last ro- Avatar The Last Airbender. It's a Japanese rock band formed in 1997 in Kyoto, signed to Universal Music. Oh, I hate that label. Of Japan. <laughs> and managed by, <laughs> yeah. and managed by Badass. Sponsor, and then you're welcome. <laughs> yeah, yeah, then we love you. They're the ones that block <laughs> everything, by the Produce way. Produce our album with no contract. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Don't block any of our reactions, please. We'd appreciate it. Universal <laughs> Music, it's pretty much the Universal Music Group, but and they're managed by Badass, whoever that is. Amazing name. Their music styles are a mix of rock, punk, heavy metal, reggae, hip hop, guitar pop, and bossa nova. That's like every fucking genre. Like, <laughs> yeah, I fucking love bossa nova. <laughs> Did we miss a genre? <laughs> there's, no, there's no country in there. Thank there's God. No, oh, okay. There's this, no country. I really want to listen to that. <laughs> I mean, got everything here. This is the ending yeah, yeah, for the. We should do this for our uh, the... Patreon next week. There Let's we go. Do it. What's the band in the song? This is for an anime feet, movie the called The First Slam Dunk, and it's by Dai Zero Khan. Okay. Oh, Ten Feet is the name of the song. I mean, cool. straight to number one. That's crazy. I mean, it's probably good to mention the, the band and the name of the song. I did say that. I said it in the beginning. <laughs> Ten <know>. feet. <laughs> Ten zero. feet. Cool. Cool. All Looks right. interesting. I love that blend of styles. Can I just say real quick before we move on? I'm seeing one of the bands on the top ten tonight. Nice. Who? One OK Rock. Oh yeah, that's true. Oh, right on. Yeah, they're Where are you opening, seeing them? The Target Center in Minneapolis. They're opening for uh, Evanescence and Muse. But we're gonna stream so, all day. Oh, it's gonna be yeah, a pretty gonna... crazy show. Three huge bands. Yeah, that's gonna be a pretty crazy show. You man. should go live afterwards and report on One OK Rock. Be interested in hearing yeah. your thoughts of the yeah, live maybe concert. I will. I'll join you. Let me know if you do. That'd oh, be cool sweet. To, that'd be okay. cool to talk about. So is, is Muse the headliner for that? Or yeah. is it a co okay? Muse I predict that one OK Rock will be the best band and Wave's gonna be blown away and then it's gonna knock Muse off his top. Top favorite have you band. heard one okay rock alan i have i don't think that's gonna happen but okay yeah i listened <laughs> i i found the set list from the chicago show they played last night and started listening to the songs and they're <laughs> i mean they're okay but kind of like what we were just talking about with american music is the vocalist is amazing but yeah. the music still has yet to impress me mm. <laughs> you know which is weird because they've inspired so many of the bands we listen to. Yeah. Well, I've only heard two of their songs. Yeah. So I'm speaking no, that's out pretty accurate, ignorance though. right now. That's pretty. I, I've I've probably heard like ten, and I would probably say the exact same thing. That Taka is one of the best, at least male uh, vocalists out there for for rock. You know, I, I just absolutely that's what you... love his vocal. Oh, okay. I'm excited to hear him sing live. I disagree. Yeah. Rio's the best. <laughs> no, I said I said one. <laughs> you, you saw like the comments on my Yoyoka documentary. It's like she's not the best, and I'm like, I said one of the best. <laughs> <laughs> <What>? <laughs> 
no, no wave. It has to be the best or you're wrong. <laughs> <laughs> For more Gaijin goodies like you just saw, be sure to subscribe to the Gaijin Guys podcast and turn on all notifications to be part of the live stream every Sunday. You can also find us wherever you listen to podcasts, Spotify, iTunes, etc. Uh, you can find even more exclusive content and reactions on our Patreon, patreon.com slash Uh I'll see you there. Adios.